A couple of months ago, I had some girls come over for a cooking class, and for my first class, I wanted to make the recipe simple and delicious. So I'm gonna be making the dessert from that night, a vanilla berry shortcake, perfect for berry season. I love food and I love to cook. The best stories are shared in the kitchen and at the dinner table. I'm Andrea and these are my cook tales. Having girlfriends in the kitchen with me makes me so happy. So I finally decided to turn it into an actual cooking class and it was so much fun. Just a few gals sharing stories, laughing and cooking together. This recipe was created for that class, and since it's berry season and we all love a good refreshing dessert, I think you should try it too. Whisk together two cups of all-purpose flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, a half teaspoon of salt, and five tablespoons of sugar. Using a pastry cutter or fork, cut six tablespoons of butter into the dry mixture until it looks like coarse cornmeal. In a measuring cup, add one cup of heavy cream, the seeds from one vanilla bean, and a half teaspoon of vanilla extract. Mix together well so the vanilla bean seeds are all broken up. Make a well in the dry ingredients and pour in the heavy cream mixture. Fold everything together until the dough starts to form. Dump onto a floured surface and bring the dough together until incorporated, but do not overmix. Press the dough out into a 3 4 inch disc and cut the shortcakes into circles with a large cookie cutter. Place on a lined baking sheet, brush the tops with heavy cream, sprinkle with sugar, and bake in a 400 degree oven for about 12 minutes or until golden. Let the shortcakes cool while making the filling. Stir together two cups of your favorite berries and two tablespoons of sugar. Let this mixture sit at room temperature for about 30 minutes. I'm using raspberries, blackberries, and blueberries, but you can use any berries you want. In another bowl, combine one cup of cream with three tablespoons of powdered sugar and a dash of vanilla extract, and whip until soft peaks form. Cut the shortcakes in half, fill with berries, and top with whipped cream. so good. This is not your traditional strawberry shortcake. The extra berries just give it such a brightness and freshness, which makes sense because it is berry season. But what's really interesting are the vanilla beans. They bring out such a depth of flavor and a sweetness to this whole thing and just bring it all together. I could eat three of these. For details and for more stories and recipes, visit andreascooktails.com. You guys go ahead and hit the subscribe button and watch more videos. I'm going to keep eating this shortcake and probably get two more.